Hello friends, how are we doing? I believe that you guys are doing great and you are taking very good care of yourself. This part of what is happening across the globe, but you and I are alive today. It's not because we are smarter, not because we are stronger, or not because we are eating good food. I just believe that it is the grace of God. And please remember, every single day when you woke up, you know, take time and thank God, and also pray for peace across the globe. So I'm not here to preach to you, but um, I'm here to discuss a bit, and you know, I know it's a very hard time. We are seeing that the virus is affecting every single thing on the planet. So, you know, all the companies are closing down. We see the airports also stopping the flights. We also see uh, the countries are closing their, they're closing their borders. And also as well, the, the global economy is also going down. And, you know, we as students, we're not going to school, we're not parents, we're not going to work. And there's a lot of things happening, you know. Uh, today in the world and so I'm here to share with you and it's not only affecting affecting you know only outside but as our lives as well are touched by this uh, situation so and today I was talking with my friend you know a friend of mine we're sharing things and we're thinking about a lot of things that are going on you know in this really hard time and you know you might also feel powerless, you may feel depressed, you know, you might also feel like your life does not have meaning in this time because, you know, you, you, you just you work up, you eat, you sleep, you work up, you eat and sleep. So this is a being a circle, you do it over and over again. Whenever you try to do something, you feel like your life, you know, it is not coming. And today I'm here to really help you with some of your things that we are going to share together in this video so I believe that you know you will be helped you do not skip this video so just stay tuned and discover secret that I'm going to share with you today let's go friends on my channel Lee Solutioner Problem Solvers so it is a platform dedicated to the young Africans young Congolese of the diaspora because today here we are talking about entrepreneurship investment leadership and also some business content why because I do believe that as Africans and as Congolese we need to rely on those you know pillars in order to develop our countries and our continent so if you are interested remember to subscribe because you're gonna receive more and more videos about uh, these topics okay because I believe that you have something to bring to the continent you have something to do in the continent for it to develop okay so here today I'll be talking about the situations as you know the situation is not really a good across the globe and this is out of control and a lot of people are complaining a lot of you know life is no longer the same you know uh, I'm a student you know I used to go to school I need to meet friends we talk we laugh and then we, we go to the library we sit read some books but this is no longer the case things have changed you know and now we are home we are just inside we are indoors we don't go out and my question is like how do you do like, what do you do during this time because some people they feel powerless they feel depressed you know when they try to do something things are not just coming for them you just feel like eating sleeping eating sleeping you do it over and over over and over it just becoming your life now today I'm here to break that cycle to just break it because it is not your life it is not what you are supposed to be doing do not blame anybody this is out of control even the president of America cannot give solution to this 
problem. Now, what am I talking about is what? Some of, some of us are good at doing things that, you know, helping them to grow because this is, uh, you know, time for us to do, you know, uh, you, know you know, things that we love to do. And I, I want just to tell you, you know, you're still trying things but are not coming. Let me tell you something. I call this day, like, I, I, this video, as you see, of 40 days of prisons equal to the 40 days of you changing your life. Now I call it the 40 days challenge. That means in the next, listening to me today, in the next 40 days, we should, you know, level up our life. We should take our life higher and higher, higher and higher. This is the objective of this video. So now today, what I'm going to share with you is that we have uh, 40, 40 days, uh, it's a 40 days challenge. In one day, we have 24 hours, okay? 24 hours. And then I can tell you that you can sleep maybe eight hours, you know, in a day. This is, you know, uh, you know, hours of a normal person that can sleep. But if you are aspires to, you know, you have aspirations to greater things, you know, you can't afford to sleep eight hours in a day. Now, if you take that, you sleep eight hours in a day, that's perfectly fine. Now, if you sleep eight hours in a day, this is like, uh, you know one third of your day and if we take it to 40 days that will be uh 320 hours in 40 days i'm uh 320 uh divided by 24 is 14 days that means in 40 days you have uh 14 days of a sleep oh my goodness so you have 14 days of sleep now you are left only with 26 days now my question is how are you going to use the 26 days question I mean today here that's why I just propose myself to share with you some of the tips that you have to do from today and your life will change from today in listening to me it just show that you are graced and you have you know things that you are supposed to do and you have that honor to take your life higher to another dimension to another level and if you only apply things that I'm going to share with you if you feel just such do not hesitate you can get in touch with me we can just help each other because it's the time where we, we should get closer to each other we should feel love from each other we should support each other because man I'm not saying that is the, the end of the world, you know. You know, some people they don't do nothing, you know, they saying that okay, you know, Christ is coming soon, is the end of the world. I mean, this is not a rapture. Right? And although Christ is coming soon, but at least He should find you ready and then just be doing what you're supposed to be doing, you know. It doesn't mean that if Christ is coming, you need to stop doing what you love, you know, what you're, you're, you're passionate about. So now we see that you have 26 days. The first thing that I want to share with you today, if you have a plan, you know, what I'm asking you today is take action. Stop procrastinating, please. Stop procrastination. Stop it. Because this is not going to help you for what I'm going to share with you today. Now, you take your planner, if you have a planner, you take your planner, you plan for 40 days. You take your pen, write every single thing that you want to do every single day. For some of you, maybe you want to read 30 minutes every single day. Just write it down. For some of you have been planning maybe to, to read, you know, the New Testament, you know, that you never read before. Please, you know, just, just, just read it, you know, just read all of it. If you are maybe planning, you know, you are maybe planning to, you know, to fast three times a week. Just this is the time. I mean, you are maybe far, you know, planning to write a book that you've been postponing, postponing over. You just postponing, postponing. This is the time where you need to sit and write your book. And I think that if you give yourself discipline, your time, the real things that you want to do in these 40 days, just write them down properly. And every single day when you wake up, make sure you read all the to do or you read your to-do list and things that you're supposed to do that day. The end of the day, make sure, read them and make sure that you achieve every single uh, every single uh, task that you were supposed to accomplish at that specific day. 
it's it's something that you see simple but i'm telling you it works when you are accountable to yourself the thing is if you don't do nothing you don't disappoint your president you don't disappoint your government you don't disappoint your family the end of the day you disappoint yourself now if you don't disappoint if you don't want to disappoint yourself it's time to take action and give 150 percent and avoid procrastination so this is what we are telling i'm telling you after this time you meet a lot of friends outside they will tell you you know after these 40 days i believe they're gonna meet people outside they will, you know your friends they will tell you you're gonna ask each other how do you spend your time how did you do friend will tell you okay i've learned these new skills i've read 40 you know i've, I've read five books I've, I've 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 read this i've done this so my question is what will you do what will you say to your friends Question. I mean that's why I'm telling you today if just you do it friend just do it it's gonna help you it's gonna change your life you know it is the time whereby you know I know it's not easy you know if you see listening to news about corona listening listening to what people are saying this is not what you listen is not going to stop corona I'm telling you you know you know in a due time God himself will do his will God will just stop it it will stop very soon soon very very soon but not in the next 40 days this is what i say uh let's give ourselves maybe three months ahead or, or 90 days and we need to survive during this time okay you know what i'm saying that do not say that your life is ending by here you know we still alive i'm telling you that you you will live after this our time so what i'm saying is life is not stopping here try to make your life valuable because at the end of the day if you just apply what i've said what i'm telling you you the end of the day people will testify people will tell you that oh man you've grown oh man you've changed be those people passionate by personal development read listen to it to, to all some audios so uh, uh, you know uh, watch some videos that inspire you you know just do things that can, can help you you want to read the story of your country you want to see the story of Africa so just go and do it this is the time where we need to to read things that really are valuable things you know i'm not saying that you can't watch a movie no i'm not saying that you can't talk to your friend no but every single thing has its own time you know we should just plan what i'm saying just run things in order from morning to evening you make sure that you achieve what you supposed to do this is what I'm telling you I'm applying. Like my Sophia, I've started uh, writing my book, a very short book where I'm explaining how entrepreneurship can impact the economy of a nation. And especially uh, Congo, my country, I'm writing that book, I've studied, you know, and it's really, really great. I'm making some researches, I'm reading some stories, and I'm discovering a lot of things about my country. And then if not for this time, I couldn't even start. And it's come and I start doing it and say, come on, these things are really going. Let me just share with people. Let me share with people. Tell them, you know, some people have been, maybe you are singing, you know, you know how to sing. It's time to maybe think about how to write your own chorus, how to write your own songs. Maybe after this time, you can record them and, and put it out here, release it out here, and, and, and people will listen to it. You see what I mean? You see what I'm talking about? So, if you feel that you know you're going through this hard time you feel some you know need to change please do not do, 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 do not procrastinate do not procrastinate do not be a procrastinator i'm just asking you to take action i'm calling for action i'm calling for action do not procrastinate man give it 150 percent and make it happen and in 40 days let's talk about new things i believe that your life will change and you'll never be the same so thank Thank you so much guys for listening to me so if you know friends you, you know that they, they can be helped by this videos do not hesitate to share with them and i believe that you guys are going to be helped most coming stay tuned and take good care of yourself please this situation is going to end very very soon let not panic they just be doing as you know you know life goes on and i believe that god is is protecting us so i pray for peace and i believe that the few things that i have to share with you you know to help you to change your life so for now i see bye